Hey, my name is Austin Childress. I am the Director of Education for Carabell Coffee here in Newport, Kentucky. And these videos are brought to you by Roasty Coffee. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about a flat white. So, flat white is an interesting drink. There's kind of different ways it can be made all over. Um, the original one came from Australia um, and New Zealand. That's kind of where this originated. Um, the idea is that you're gonna have this really nice espresso drink that has good foamy texture, uh, not too much foam like a cappuccino might have, uh, and it's gonna have that nice strong espresso taste. But it's kind of evolved and it lands in a couple of different fields now. Sometimes it's bigger, sometimes it's not foamy at all. So I'm gonna leave that there and I'm gonna tell you how I make my flat white. Um, so for me today, I'm gonna use about a six ounce cup. Uh, it would be one that a cappuccino would typically be served in, but I'm gonna steam my milk to the same temperature as a cappuccino, but put less foam into it. So it's not gonna be quite as fluffy and airy uh, as a cappuccino might be. It's gonna be a little more dense. Maybe you'll get a little bit more of that kind of coffee flavor in it, um, but here we go. I'm gonna make one for you and show what it's like. So I'm gonna be putting about 16 and a half grams of ground coffee into my porta filter. It should fit pretty well if you are brewing espresso at home. I'm gonna brew directly into my cup for my flat white. go ahead and steam my milk, listening for just those little gentle paper tearing sounds. And then I just continue to heat it up until it feels just hot to the touch, like I don't want to touch it anymore. And that should land me about 140 degrees, degrees or so Fahrenheit. When you're done steaming your milk and pulling your shot, you'll have your espresso here in the cup and you'll have your steamed milk that should look like wet, glossy paint if you kind of swirl it around in your pitcher a little bit. So when I go to pour this, I'm gonna start about three or four inches up, just nice and gentle into it. Right, and there is our flat white. The idea is you have that really nice, clean, flat surface. It's gonna be a, a nice little bit of foam on there, but not too much, not too little. And that is how I make a flat white. <laughs>